Well, I thought, what we did with my picture was marvellous. And um, I said to Trish, you know, it would be lovely to do something like that in, within the group. Yeah. Um, I really enjoyed the session. It was quite interesting to see how that we can incorporate technology um, and actually incorporate that into the visual art practice. And it's given me a lot of ideas uh, that might, I might investigate later on. So yeah, it's fantastic. Um, maybe how we can use technology to supplement new works of art. Uh, maybe how I can actually explore that further with some of my students here at Rosetta and incorporate some of the things that I learned today. Um, yeah, I think that's it's been very useful. Um, I already can't remember the morning. <laughs> <laughs> yes, just the quick survey of, of what you might be able to show us. And um, I thought we'd get more instruction, but I really like the overview. Why did I come? Um, because I haven't learned anything new in video at all for several years. And rather than reading magazines, I welcomed the input. And also I thought it was going to be more specific for our dance group. And since I'm interested in capturing movement, I thought there would be things which were useful for that. I'm an artist. <laughs> Always happens. I moved, my first training was sculpture, and then I went to graphics, and I went to computer graphics, and I went to video, and I went to sound. I got a master's in sound art, sonic art, and animation, so whatever, whatever's useful for my projects. Relevant for me, possibly not, but I still like the idea. I like, I like having something in my pocket that does everything I need while I'm out, so I'm interested in it, but I haven't looked into it yet. So also combine um, electronic media with, with old media, paper or some kind of material or fabric or sound. I don't, I'm never completely electronic, so there's some element of presence of the material as well, so it's quite a long stretch from there to mobile. I don't know if this is the first time I've been to this community centre, but um, I came because this morning was offered to our dance group, which is at uh, Stratford Circus. And it's uh, contemporary dance for over 50. Some of the people went into their 70s, and apparently there's one man who's over 100 who sometimes comes. And it's extremely good for um, mind-body coordination, uh, it's like an exercise where if there's a movement you can't do, you can do a version that you can do. For example, there are lots of exercises that I can't do because I have arthritis. But since I can vary it myself to fit in with what we're doing, I can do the movement so I get the exercise and the rhythm. Mm -hmm. So that's very, very helpful for older people. Exactly, mind-body coordination, mind-movement coordination. Very, very good. Okay. You want to ask me? So, uh, how was the, um, the experience? This is a uh, video to support the project for the next time, so we can Before refund you record, it. Let me tell you what I think. It wasn't mm. what I expected. Um, oh, uh, yeah, because when me. they came to the class, they told us, it, well, we took the students said it was a more about using the phones. But it was on the morning, this thing about the phones. Okay, we didn't know that. Uh, and I was teaching. No, no, it was more like um, dropping. Like. Yeah, but it, I thought you said it was from 1.30 to 3.30. That's the message I got. We so start at 11 until 1.30. See, I didn't know that. I could yeah. have come had I known that. But it and it was more me. about phones. And yes, that would have been more beneficial for me. Yeah. But the afternoon wasn't much, so I don't want to yeah. say anything yeah, that's going to hinder that, yeah, your project. Okay. Yeah, it was really good. It kind of showed me, like, within my work, how I can use technology in, you know, like, a different way. So, like, um, for my projects at university, I can use all these different technologies, such, such as, like, the video mapping in, like, the stuff that I want to do for my projects there. Um, most of like the videography stuff, um, how I can use the technology that I've already got, such as my phone and my laptop, and apply that to work that I'm doing at the moment. 